Of course I am. I gotta stop commentating first. If you were landed on that tap platform, I think you would have had that game. I don't know why. Like, I tried to down B off the ledge twice in a row, and it came out of side B both times. There was also a time where I did an up air, up air, up B, and the side B came out instead of the Duh. up B. Like, I don't know how that happened three times. Anyway. <laughs> This isn't about me. It's about winner semis. Uh, Nam versus Ryuga. When Nam versus Ryuga is winner semis, you know we've got a stacked tournament. Because <laughs> yeah. I know a lot of Michigan tournaments where this would be winner's finals. Oh Ooh. my gosh. Yeah, that that's the same call that uh, just bodied me in crew battles. I feel like I want like Ryuga and oh my. He's so fluid. So crispy. That's crazy. Whoo! <laughs> it was weird. I actually thought uh, Raigu was dropping Ike for Corrin. Corrin got even nerfed. Corrin ate some heavy nerfs, actually. And uh, I well, think he just got sick of, like, even though Corrin is, like, a higher tiered character than Ike, he, he's sick of losing because of, like, character disadvantage, and he just wants to play a top tier. And. Cloud is a very good character, and uh, he's very similar to Ike and Corrin in a lot of ways. I feel like a very good character is an mm -hmm. understatement. Cloud is oh, just so good. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> uh, I feel like I should have laughed at that. Nam feels now how I did just a minute ago. Like, I need Cody to teach me how to do that. What did... Uh, Just stand there and what? wait for them to do something. What? Oh. What? How can someone be that good at this game? Look at this. Look at this. Ryuga calls him out. These are the top player reads, right? So the top player privilege. You just... Like, yeah. Okay. If I were to do that, I would get punished so hard for it. You just read the drop shield. That's all. <laughs> like... High-level players will read the smallest of things. Now I'm looking a little confused here, not sure what to do. Is Fox that bad against Cloud? Um, it's a bad matchup for Fox, from what I hear from most people, but like not awful. All right, we're going to Cheek and Lilat though. Lilat. Not really a stage Cloud likes. Uh, sitting on these platforms while he's charging limit, like most characters can hit through these platforms, right? So he's not really safe when he's charging limit at any point. In addition to that, sometimes the Lilat tilts are just unpredictable, and if he doesn't have his limit break, he can get caught under the stage. Oh, this is actually looking really good for him for now. Oh, yeah. Great start. This seems like the one matchup where Nam feels comfortable uh, against Cloud. Sheik. Yeah. I know it probably still breaks his heart to use Sheik, but hey, man, sometimes he just got to. He says he likes Sheik uh, to an extent now. You just you have to work harder now with her. Well, I know um, after he won the 1v1v bro, he's like, I have to learn how to win a tournament without she. Yeah, I think he just doesn't want to rely on counterpicking people. He wants a character that's like, he knows he can win. Uh, he knows he can beat anybody with that character. And maybe other characters will give him a better chance, but he doesn't necessarily, he doesn't feel stuck if he gets counterpicked, you know? I think that's what he's looking for. I think that's a nice way to think about things too. Like a good mentality boost kind of thing. Yeah, that's if how you he can felt. Find your character. That's how he felt with pre patch cheek, because pre patch cheek had no bad matches. <laughs> oh wow. <laughs> that was silly. Lilat is weird. I hate this stage so much. You and everyone else. Yeah, every everything <laughs> like like, <laughs> I hate this stage, man. Anyway. This stage, uh, I always feel like I see more grounded play on this stage than most, just because of how the platforms kind of cave people in. Oh, that was so good. 
He, Why does that move have to be so good? He jumped uh, off that platform for just a second to charge limit. Nam came in to like try to pressure him, and he dropped down with an up air, knowing that Nam that was exactly what Nam tried to do. And if you haven't seen the hitbox for uh, Cloud's up air, you don't want to <laughs> see it. <laughs> it's huge, man. It's huge. You'll lose all faith in this game if you see it. Oh, my gosh. When Ryuga gets a hit, man, he just carries like so much momentum. Ooh. Yeah, he capitalizes on like everything so well. Yeah, when he hits you, he knows exactly when you're gonna try to come in and break pressure. He knows when you're gonna panic and air dodge. I love his uh, mix-ups, too, where he's just crossing Nam up and changing up what aerials he does. Is he going to hit the front of my shield? Is he going to uh, read a roll and throw a back air? Is he going to hit the back of my shield? Oh, my oh, gosh. I felt like he didn't need that second nair. I thought he would have been far enough out where he could have just let him die. I'm not sure. Maybe I can replay that for us. Oh, I thought he was going to cross slash right there. All right, the dot the dash dance is not what? Oh, what? No, wow. That's that was that, something. That, that was happened. silly actually. That was a thing that happened right there. <laughs> a thing that happened. I could have said that myself. <laughs> 